All right, everyone. I told you I was going to do it. Let's see what I carry in my pockets now. Yes, it's the EDC 2. What's going on, everybody? How are you doing out there on YouTube? Again, this is Chaz Barber coming to you. Um, I wanted to take the day. Um, I and know if you watched my last video, uh, then you would see that I told you that I wanted to be a little bit more, uh, get back get back to everything here in YouTube. With that being said, I made a promise to everybody. I made a promise to you guys that I would continue to show you guys what my EDC is. Now again, what my EDC was in my first video is a little bit different than what my EDC is right now. Um, and EDC again stands for Everyday Carry. So again, um, here's what I'll do. I, I figured that I would, uh, We'd, we'd go ahead, I'd show you guys what I carry around. Then again, this isn't what I do for my gigs or, or anything. This is just what I carry around on an everyday basis. Um, so we'll go through it. I don't carry as much with me in the winter as I do in the summer because uh, during the winter time, to be honest, I don't go out that much. Uh, it's cold. It's very cold in Jersey, uh, believe it or not. So we don't go out as much, but when I do go out, I do like to have some stuff on me. So I wanted to show that to you guys. Hope you like it. Check it out. So, uh, like I said, I do not carry as much stuff with me as I do during the winter uh, than what I do in the summer. If you didn't have a chance to check out my first video, though, uh, do me a favor. Pause this video. Go into the description. I'm going to put the link for the first video in the uh, description area. So go ahead, check out that video. Then come back to this one. You can see how everything has changed. Okay, cool. So we'll start off with the classic. I always do carry a deck of playing cards. My deck of playing cards of choice as of right now is the S.W. Erdenace deck, the Expert at the Card Table deck. This is from Illusionist. Um, this is, a, again, yep, a deck from Illusionist. Um, I believe this is a Madison deck. I'm, don't hold me to that. Please don't don't beat me up too bad much in the, con in the comments if it's not. Um... But I get, I just get, I lose track of my cards sometimes, and I lose track of the, the history and the backing and of them sometimes. So if I did screw that up, I do apologize. But again, um, I do love this deck. It's a very nice deck uh, to carry. Very simplistic. I'm a big fan of very simplistic decks, um, of simplistic playing card designs and everything. So that is uh, my my carry, the one that I'm carrying currently carrying around. Currently carrying around. Okay. So that one. As always, I keep it inside of a card clip. This clip you have seen before. This is uh, a card clip made by Ryan Edwards. I am a huge fan of Ryan Edwards' work. Um, Ari Handcrafted. I will put a link for his website in the description as well. Um, definitely, if you have a sec, please go check him out. Um, I actually was just talking to him this past week on a couple other things that I want to be working on with him and he decided to tell me that this one, this ostrich uh, clip, yes this is a, a clip made out of uh, ostrich skin. The way that he did the uh, wide spine right there, um, there's only two clips in the world that are like this one. This is one of them. So I think that it's very safe to say that I'm going to be retiring this clip very soon and I'm a big fan of card clips it's just a conversation piece um, a lot of magicians will carry around decks of cards but just putting them out like that I think it is a much bigger statement uh, it's a conversation piece and I am definitely a huge fan of the card clips uh, number two number two two things that I always carry around or I guess this is number three if you include uh, these all separately, but uh, next th I, the next thing that I carry around are rubber bands. I always carry around rubber bands. Um, I do like I like doing rubber band tricks. Uh, rubber band tricks are really cool, really easy, and they're something that don't take up any pocket space. Um, so I don't have to take up any pocket space. I can have them right on my wrist, and they're good to go. And again, conversation piece. Uh, somebody looks at you as why you have so many rubber bands on your wrist, you can show them something. 
I'm not saying that you should go out with that mentality, but if it does come up, at least you have an answer for that. Um, and again, people do tend to like rubber band uh, magic because they've seen rubber bands, they know rubber bands, they it, it's common item, so people do like seeing that. Um, so that is that. Next thing that I've been carrying around, it is winter time, so I have been carrying around a little trick called Redline. Yes, a little trick called Redline. This is from a gentleman named Dan Haas. Um, originally sold on his, the Theory 11 website. I do not believe that it is being sold anymore. Basically, the idea of the trick is that you take the cap off of the chapstick and you're able to make it vanish or throw it and it appears right back on the chapstick. Love this trick. It's great. It's right in my pocket. Um, I'm very much a fan of uh, flip stick or, or color changing knives. So if I don't have the color changing knives, then I switch it out with this. So during winter time, I carry around chapstick. During around the summer months, then I'll carry around the color changing knives as from the first video. Great trick. If you haven't seen this or you don't know who Dan Haas is, take a moment, pause this, go and check it out. Okay? And last but not least, I have my wallet. Again, same thing as before. I carry around a couple tricks inside of my wallet. Um, I carry around uh, specifically uh, two tricks, one called Transfer, uh, which just came out with from Penguin Magic. I cannot seem to remember the name off of the of the creator please uh, don't be too mad I just can't seem to recall it right now I'm having a brain fart and I do apologize I will uh, get that back to you um, and then I also carry extreme burn which is a build change I only do uh, ones to tens um, but it's a really visual trick you show one two three four dollar bills or you can do five dollar bills and you can change them into four or five of a different currency like i said i do ones to tens um you can do ones to twenties you can do magazine clips to hundreds you can do ones to hundreds it's a great trick great trick it's visual people love it um and like i said last time i also do carry a little trick that i do with my business cards i don't want to give away that one just yet because that's a great it's a great marketing trick it's a great marketing trick that i actually want to teach you guys how to do it um but i'm going to hold off till i get uh till the channel builds up just a little bit so for those of you that are in anticipation thank you for staying with me uh thank you for your patience uh just a little bit more time and i will show you that trick that's in my wallet so guys that's pretty much it um that is my everyday carry if you like the video Please do me a favor, give the video a like. It really does help me out. It helps my channel out. Um, it helps everything out. And it just gets gets me out there in YouTube a little bit more. If you haven't already, if this is your first time seeing this, please go ahead, pause the, this video before it ends. Go check out the first Everyday Carry video. Come back to this one and then hit the subscribe button. Uh, Really, again, if you, if you guys want to keep seeing more content, seeing what I'm doing, seeing what I'm putting out there, go ahead, hit that subscribe button. It really does help me out. And as always, I will catch you guys next time. I hope that you enjoyed that. Have a good one. I'll see you later.